there are many arguments to stay in and there are many arguments that come out, but the one thing that we've got, we ought to kill this canard now, is that not one job in Britain is at risk because of EU membership. Not one. Not one. I love the stainless steel works, I love to be given the opportunity to carry on working there. But I just don't know at the moment. Well, the Tories were the ones that promised to save steel. Yeah, but now it's come to fruition. That's in lot, there's, not, there's not a lot of opportunities left in this area. Voted Conservative in the past? Yes. When? I think it was Brexit I did. Um, did you vote Leave? Yes. What was the main reason? Well, it was, um, you see, I, I see the European Union as a lot of, un well, a lot of them are unelected. Or I don't know if you know your local European, you, when we was in there, your local European uh, MEP. Nobody does. That you, so you voted right today. How do you feel about that vote now? Have you done it differently? Probably would have done it differently, you know, the way the world's going, because it's a lot more unstable than it was seven years ago. You see, you think of the Tory party, you think of a party who are concerned with business. And they're, they're, they're the party that does business. So financially, you know, the party... You think that, and you see Labour as some sort of socialist and the other trade unionist sort of party, and you think you get more done with the Tories, and that hasn't happened. They haven't created any jobs. Why do you think? Like a lot of these uh, the people who work there, they've been there 30 odd years. I say they might have children who are about to win, uh, embark on like in a career in the industry, and now they can't. So they feel like their future has been ripped away. They feel like they, you know, they got, their offspring's uh, future has been ripped away. So uh, they, it's rock bottom. Well, it's the it's chief employer, it's the biggest employer. Um, so a lot of workers there, the second, third, fourth generation employees of the steelworks, for these different forms of chorus, British steel, whatever. You, you, you're reducing the numbers massively. What's Port Talbot if it isn't a Derelict. You told Andrew Neil on the Sunday Politics programme in 2016 that not one job, job. would be lost exactly. due to Brexit. and I stand by it. I stand by it. arguments oh, stay you. in. And there are many arguments that have come out, but the one thing that we've got, we ought to kill this canard now, is that not one job in Britain is at risk because of EU not membership. One. Not one. Because there would be a free trade agreement because we're exactly. so important exactly. to Europe. And by the way, that doesn't mean that there aren't other reasons why we might want to be in or out. But I, I get so frustrated with people who go, three million jobs are at risk if we're out of the European Union. It's rubbish. And I stand by every word of that.